Welcome to tonight's evening prayer. We come at the end of this day, a busy one maybe or quiet. We come to the one who is here welcoming. So take a moment or two, settling yourself with him now. Romans 1 verse 7, grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. One who made heaven and earth has given us this day so we bring to him our joys, our failings, our sorrows. Psalm 20 verse 7. Some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord our God. Some trust in chariots and some in horses. We trust in the name of the Lord our God. When the Psalms were being written, you needed to know that you had got power or the right equipment around you so that you could escape if you needed or fight. You needed to know that you had horses and chariots. They mattered. And yet David writes, I trust, we trust in the name of the Lord our God. In his fights with Saul, they needed chariots and horses on both sides. They had the same equipment to a large to large extent but david knew that the what was the winner for him was trusting in the lord knowing that he was the one who led him who guarded him who protected his life and for us we can have all sorts of physical possessions but it is god who guards our hearts it is god who is the one that is ultimately the one we trust in. He is our provider. He is the one who knows our needs in every respect. Let's pray. Thank you, Lord, that though physical possessions are good and helpful, above all, trusting in you is what is most helpful. You are the one who understands. You are the one who goes before us and provides. We trust you and ask you to help us to keep on in trust of you. Amen. Merciful God, we entrust to your unfailing and tender care this night all who are ill or in pain, those caught up in war-torn lands, coming trusting you, knowing that whenever danger threatens, your everlasting arms are there to hold us safe. Comfort, heal and protect, and restore them to health and strength and peace. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And we pray, our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. And now, 
May life's noise be a gentle hymn to our hearts. May the soul's silence be our prayer for the world. And may we, created, be creative in our love. Amen. Bless you and sleep well.